All right. Uh, this is a real example of real life, real estate investing. This is the condo <laughs> from hell, I'll call it. Um, and I say because, you know, the experience in and of itself was a long, interesting one, I'll call it. But we got through it. Everything was done. The kitchen, kitchen is done. You can see, you know, it was done very nicely. Everything is put back together. So let me explain what I mean by put back together. Bathrooms, bedrooms, everything is put back together. So, as you can see, nice master, nice size master. Uh, bathroom, bathroom is hooked up pretty well. Uh, stand up shower for the master. Everything was done well. But the problem that we ran into was after, we'll say, had to be the good bit of a year and a half of completion, if not longer, because we had several issues. Um, one of the major issues I'll share with you is that once this place was 99% complete once before. We came in to turn to clean it. The cleaners came to clean and turn the water on. And this water heater separ separated the pipe separated in there. And it was a puddle all over the floor. And once all of that was <laughs> done, we had to have a water remediation company come in to get the water up and turn all the lights out because I'm heading out. Um, water remediation company had to come in to get it right. Got all the water up. They had to cut the walls up, take up all the flooring, which they stole the flooring. I don't understand that. They stole the flooring. Um, Took up all the flooring, had to take out the kitchen, all the cabinets in the kitchen. So let me go back in here real quick. So all of this, the bottom cabinets, everything had to be taken out. When it was taken out, they broke the granite. So we had to replace the granite, put the cabinets back in. All of that had to be done all over because of the flood. And after all that was said and done, the insurance company didn't cover it. So we had to come back in and pay for everything all over again to get it complete. And now finally again, it's complete after a long time. It's complete again. It's been cleaned and it's on the market. So it's ready to be sold. But uh, these are the stories that you don't hear about when they talk about real estate investing, because that's what I talk about is real life real estate investing. Average person, this would have broke them. This would have made them quit because hell, I knew I wanted to quit several times, but I understand that there is a lesson. I always say either I win or I learn, but I never lose. So in this situation, even though it took a little time, the value of this property went up $30,000. Even though we put an extra $30,000 into it, the value went up $30,000. So we still come out where we initially intended to from the beginning, um, but it took a long time to get here. But we're here and it's ready to go. And that's real life real estate investing.